Tracy Hockey, Blue Futon, we're going back in the box with a Shin Godzilla. Have I seen this movie? No. I've seen all the other Godzillas. I well, not the old ones, like 29 Godzillas. I've seen maybe four of them. But this is one of them that I'm about to watch from Japan, like 2016. Let me go watch this. Godzilla, not let you know if it's a good Godzilla. <laughs> See those googly eyes? You probably didn't. Let me zoom in and I'll, yeah, I'll just, uh, you probably, I'll probably already zoomed in guys when I edit it, but yeah, I just watched Shin Godzilla. What's it about? It's basically a remake of the original Godzilla with the Japanese not knowing what they're doing, like a political action disaster movie. But man, this was weird. Like, this is really weird of a movie. Like, I'm staying safe. I just hit the mic really hard, but... I, I, I really don't know what to say about this movie, guys. Like, it opened up as a political th movie, and I think this is supposed to be, like, you know, making fun of the Japanese government, how they, like, are doing stuff where they have to go through so many chains and ask so many people, if, like, what happens if Godzilla or this monster is totally ruining the Earth or just Japan itself. And with this, while they're arguing... Godzilla is metamorphosing into four stages, but the politicians are kind of acting like nothing happened. Like, oh no, what do we do now? Prime Minister, oh no, the Defense Secretary, oh no, that person, oh yeah, that geological person, oh that pathological liar, oh, that that person, that uh, cardboard cut lady, and this person. What do you think? And what do you think? And what do you think? And what do you think? 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 And during all that, what do you think? Godzilla is morphing into four things, and there's like. 100 characters when I say 100 characters like there's 100 characters guys like every time there's a new character even the character on screen for five minutes Like if I'm here, it would be like chase Lee hockey the blue futon commander of the 17th battalion of awesome sauce banana crust and you're like huh and then I'll die and then a new me would come up Meme clown weirdo from the battalion of Tokyo's 5th district into the internal hell. And now I die. And you're like, I don't even know all these characters. But I'll tell you one thing. When this movie started the first 15, 20 minutes, Godzilla was awful. Like, what the shit fuck was that? Like, I'm sorry, but when I saw that monster, I... I was like, what? <laughs> happening I I don't but yeah guys this is a weird movie uh it's like half I don't even call it half maybe 30% disaster movie 70% political thriller and it literally cuts weird and like metamorphosing Godzilla and I'm sorry this whole metamorphosing Godzilla scene and what it met metamorphosing like, into it's just too weird for me like I'm into weird movies like I'll watch some weird gory you know, like audition, old boy, weird movies like that. But this like took it to a weird like the creature design was not badass. I know some people like the creature design and people are like, oh that's cool. I'm not a fan of creature design. The story was okay. The acting was pretty weird. Uh, it was kind of funny about some of the acting, so I'll give it the humor worked in most of this movie. I don't know. It's a weird one, guys. Shin Godzilla is a weird one. So, since it is enjoyable, it's weird. Is it supposed to be weird? Yes. It's a hard movie to give it. I mean, it's one of those movies you should watch again, though. It is one of those movies where even it's so weird, you could put this on again and be like, a hey, drinking game. Weird shit's about to happen. Weird, weird, weird. And that final end scene, was those like human bodies or weird skeletons? I feel like those were the same, like, Monsters from King Kong Skull Island, like, ah! but I could be wrong. But Shin Godzilla, we'll see a two and a half out of five with food times equals at a 50%. So, see the critics' news scores that gave this film. Holy poo poo for Coco Pops, you have an 86 from the critics, which is 69, and then you have a 73 from the audience, which is about 6,500 of them. And here's the current consensus.
Shin Godzilla, our Godzilla resurgence, offers a refreshingly lo-fi and altogether entertaining return to the monster's classic feature future roots. I don't know, guys. I uh, to its roots. I don't know. I just don't know, guys. It was a weird one. I, I didn't like the feature design. I don't lie. No, not a fan of that feature design at all. But hey, what does this Westerner do? So what do you think? 86, 73, or 50? Chase out of the Blue Futon. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think is Blue Futon in Tokyo. You Blue Futonians. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. You know what I realized? I haven't watched that Godzilla anime series on Netflix. I watched the first one, but I haven't watched the second and third one. So I don't know what to do because I probably need to watch that. And I took one breath. I didn't mean to take a breath. I wanted to take one more breath because I got it. What do you do? He's like, ah! And he totally like, that was a lot of fire.